All right, let's talk fanny packs. Fanny packs are back. And some may say that I brought them back. I don't believe that. I mean, they've been around forever in Europe, but there's reasons why fanny packs kind of went out of style. One reason was because they're made of leather. Nobody wants to wear leather. Another reason is because people like to wear them like this on top of their shirt, making it very uncomfortable. Nobody wants to uh, wear their clothes like this, obviously. So that's another reason. And, and, and the third reason is because how they're designed. When you have a fanny pack with one pocket, you lose everything. So let's actually talk some fanny packs. I think I'm kind of a, an expert on this because look at my pile of fanny packs. There may be, um, I don't know, 15 in that pile. And then I got a whole bag. So we're going to go through a couple of them. And we're going to talk some fanny packs. And then, you know, they call me Fanny Pack Zach. I want to come out with my own. So maybe we can come out with an Olympic edition or something like that. But this is a, this is a, um, a hunting one, as you can see. And it's very big. It's got a couple more in there. Victoria's Secret came out with this one a couple years ago. And, like, it's cool because it says Dodgers. But, like, one pocket, it ain't going to cut it. Ain't going to cut it. You're going to lose too much stuff. Like, I haven't lost a chapstick in 12, 13, 14 years because of these side pockets. But even this doesn't work. This is two pockets. This pocket's too big. There's th you, you can't throw coins in there. They're going to get all over the place. It's too much of a mess. Out of here. The hunting one, out of here. Even these new Jordan ones that I picked up, okay? There's one pocket here, which is, which is great. This is a great design. Jordan, you're, you're, you're the man. You know, you've done it. And you have this great design, great material. It's going to keep the water out. One big pocket, and I, you know, there's nothing else. Like, there's this front pocket here, but it's kind of hard to zip, you know, open and close. As you can see, it's kind of a difficult kind of thing. So it's, it's still one, two big pockets. Like, the second pocket is medium size. So I'll wear it because it's cool, but, you know, you're out of here too, Jordan. Okay? These new ones, I got this one in Europe just now when I was in Italy, Germany, it's sim, it's, it's almost there. Like Nike, you had the design years ago. It just wasn't, it wasn't caught on yet. One big pocket ain't going to cut it, man. There's these, there's this small little pocket back here. So like this netting pocket that you can see back here, but it's still too big. It's still too big. There's still stuff that's going to get lost in here. And then there's the secret pocket, which keep the secret pocket. Nike, you got it. Okay. Still out of here. There's my bachelor party one with my brother design. That was pretty cool. Pen praise what we got on it. Now, here's we're starting to get into the design that I love. This one here is Nike. has the Nike on top, and it opens like this. It's one big pocket, right? Then we have the small side pockets where I can put my chapstick. I can put my coin. If I have change, guys out there, guys, listen. How many times do you get change? And then when you get home, you throw it in your dresser and you never use it again. And you pile it up in something. This, you can keep your coins. So then when you need it, you can just reach in there and grab it. It's amazing. Then there's another side pocket where I keep like whatever I want, whatever you want to keep. I keep Visine. You never know when you need Visine. I get stuff in my eyes all the time. Visine. What else can I keep? Oh, a little thing of ibuprofen, a little, one of those little packs of ibuprofen. So I can always have ibuprofen. This one, I hold my lighter, my chapstick. I haven't lost chapstick, guys. I actually use my whole chapstick. My whole, I, I don't lose it, okay? So that one's great. This one's great. I love this one. This is the design, Nike, you need to come back with. I think it's the heritage, um, some kind of heritage. I'll hit you up. Don't worry. We can come out with the Zach Pembrey's version, the Zach Pembrey's special for the Olympics. So me and Nike, we're going to team up. But this one, out of here because... The zipper broke. So the zipper, once the zippers break, they're done. I use mine until the zippers break. Out of here. This is a great one. The gold zippers. The gold zippers. This is the original design here. Let's see if I can find the original one. Okay. Let's start diving into this big one. This big bag of fanny packs. We're talking fanny packs now, guys. Okay. Someone bought me this one. Out of here. One big pocket. This one, yeah, it's cool, whatever. I don't know. It's a weird design. It's, it's not useful. It's not practical. Out of here. Okay? Nike, you're still on the right track. You had the front pocket, right? The little front small pocket. Still too big of a pocket. Stuff gets lost in there. 
Here's another one of the gold zippers. I designed a little bit, throw a little bit extra paint. Here, guys, the original one, the best one that you're gonna find. They don't make it anymore. Nike, I'm giving you guys the opportunity as long as you partner with me. The gold zippers set you apart. Also, the three pockets, the little side pocket where I can fit stuff that like I lose. Sometimes I take my keys off of my, like my car keys and like my house keys, I'll put them in there so I don't lose them. And it still has the secret pocket too, guys. The secret pocket, look. And in the secret pocket, if you wanna put your phone back there with headphones, it has a little thing for your headphones to go in. The three pockets is huge. Wallet, phone, notebook, in the big pocket, chapstick, lighter, visine, ibuprofen, whatever small things other you guys carry, change, coins, coins that you can actually use. Let's go. Like, this is it. This is the one right here. The original one I wore forever. The zipper actually broke and I had someone try to fix it. I actually went and took it to get fixed and then it broke like a couple weeks later. It just wasn't it. So, Nike. I know your zipper is going to break and I can be able to fix the zippers, but it, it lasts a long time. Just keep coming out with this one. So we have all these ones over here. I even have Lulu. My homie's at Lululemon. Okay. You're almost there. Here's the downfall of the Lululemon one. The zipper, if it's too light, if, if there's nothing in here holding it down, like if it's just your wallet or just your phone, when you go to pull up the zipper to open it up, it actually lifts the fanny pack off of your waist. So, like you're, you're there struggling, so you can't use it with one hand. I'm big on being able to use it with one hand. I coach, so if I want to be able to just zip my, unzip it with, with one hand, I, I want to. But if there's no weight in there, the zipper ain't going to work. I have to use both hands. So, you know, we got we to gotta think about these little things. And I'm the master tester of all these things. I use a fanny pack until the zippers break. Even here, Lou Lemon. Almost there, the zipper cannot go this way. This is not a thing on a fanny pack. It's just, you're lifting it up too much, it's too much. There is a secret pocket in here, a little small pocket inside, it's whatever, okay? And then the front pocket, it's still too big, okay? So Lulu, I love you guys, but you know what? The fanny pack ain't there yet. Don't worry, Nike's been doing it for a long time and they still don't even have it, okay? There's more, another Jordan one, some more Jordan ones. I went crazy, I bought eight fanny packs in 30 days, including the fanny pack sandals, which are never gonna be used as far as fanny packs. But these here, too big, too big. Also, the straps matter as well. The straps matter, so you know what? I'm gonna come out with my own fanny pack. It's gonna have three pockets and a secret pocket, and it's gonna have just the right thing, and everyone's gonna buy it. Because Nike, you were there, so you inspired me to use your design to, I wouldn't say fully copy it, but you know what, somewhat be inspired. Someone gave me this one and it has a, a drink holder on the side. I mean, come on guys, this, this stuff, is, this is just catchy stuff, this is stupid. Like, let's go, another, another Lululemon one. You know, there's a Camelback one that I have. A Camelback one that actually holds water. It has the Camelback pouch inside. You can fill it up with water and you can walk with it but really not useful other than the water. So you're out of here too, man. And the Pempre's Red Hawks one. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy, look at that. Number six with the signature on there. So we have this one and you know what? I like it, I love it. Thank you Red Hawks for doing this night for me. But this wears off too much. It's just cheaply put together. It's fine. It's just, you know, thank you. It was just, a, it was cool. So, but this is not really a practical fanny pack. Like it's going to break and uh, the, the stitches are going to break. It's one big pocket. It's really not useful. So temperate fanny packs, you're out of here too. All right. So even these running ones, people say like, I want a small one just for my phone and my wallet. This only fits a phone. So you're out. Adidas, not a big fan of any, anything really Adidas. Um, and one big pocket in the secret pocket, not gonna cut it. I mean, these ones, everyone's seen these old school ones. Most of the reason why fanny packs went out of stock because these old school ones. I mean, we got to adjust to the market, guys. And here's another one with three pockets. Nike, you had it, you're on it. You're on it. Roots, really not useful. One big pocket made of cloth, man, yeah, whatever. So we're talking fanny packs. I mean, cool, they're collectibles, look at this. 
Toronto Blue Jays won again from uh, from Pink or Victoria's Secret. Not useful. It's been in my bag since I bought it. And um, another Pempre's what one. So as you can see, my bag is pretty much empty. And there's a couch full of fanny packs and even a floor full of fanny packs. So we're talking fanny packs. Fanny pack Zach here. <laughs> got to have more than one big pocket and you can't even have a medium sized pocket because stuff gets lost in there as well. So let me know what you guys think. Give me some comments, share this video and let's make this like fanny pack thing a real thing. Now, what do you think? I'm in. Are you?